This is Blake Wong from Zular Industrial Limited. And now we are a company who produces the hydroelectric press machine and hydraulic press machine and die cast machine and some other hydraulic or pneumatic components. And now I want I want to introduce our machine, the TLY, one of our hydraulic hydropneumatic press machine. And now it's a pneumatic press machine. This is called TLYA series. And now I want to introduce to the TLYA series. The pneumatic TLYA series press is a completely self-contained pneumatic unit that is cost effective and can be used in a variety of assembly and forming applications, including punching, marking, sticking, cutting, prepping, and flaring. Our TLYA series presses cut down on air consumption, but still deliver the maximum force required for your application. Okay, now I want to introduce this machine. This is a machine uh, who, who used for punching holes on the belt. You can see a finished one, like this, this one. So when we press, when we use this machine to press and it, press it, so it will punch a hole like this. And now let's uh, operate this machine. Firstly, we should uh, connect the air supply. This is the air supply. So, uh, You can see it. this is the uh, air pressure board. Now it's 0 0.7. 0 .7. This is the start button. We turn off the start button. And, and this is a machine, a heating machine. This is the upper die heating. This is the heating mode. This is the upper. This one is the upper, upper mode. And this one is the lower mode. Both of them are heating mode. And uh, when we start the pump, you can see we set we set the temperature at 180 degrees, and now it's 157 degrees. And for and in for in reference to the lower temperature display, we set it at uh, 170 degrees, and now it's 151 degrees. So when it when when both of them reaches its set heat temperature, so we can press the belt. We can start to press the belt. So now let's wait for it. And this time we can introduce our machine. This is the air pressure board, and is this is the air filter regulator this is the button of air pressure button and this is the sensor this is a solid one and this one you can see it's a protector protective cover and it's functioning to protect your hands you know when this one when this mode when this Press down, so maybe it's dangerous for your hand. Maybe it will press your hand, so it's very dangerous. So we design this protective cover to protect your hand from pressing down it from it. And this is a pneumatic pneumatic cylinder produced by ourselves. You can see this is a parameter of this pneumatic cylinder. It's there. The cylinder diameter is 100 
is 100 millimeters, and its total stroke is 100 millimeters, and its adjustable stroke is 15 millimeters, and its force its force is 300 kilograms. So this is the pneumatic cylinder. And now, and now I want to introduce this one. This one. Do this one. You can see we can we can adjust, adjust, adjust. We can adjust the adjustable stroke. The adjust, adjustable stroke is this. It's adjusted by this. And this one. This one will into the open head, open height, the open height, lower of of hair, lower of hair is to adjust the open head. And this one is a counter. So how many times you count at one hour or one day? So you can see it from, from this counter. And now the temperature is close to the set temperature. So we can begin. We can now begin the brushing. Now let's begin. So wait, this is the part this okay. Let let me introduce the plastic cover first. This is the plastic cover. From protecting your hands, being dangerous, so you can be safe, not safe. You can put the belt to the hose, and then start press the start button. Yeah, so you can see effective, effect, perfect, very good. So it's so now it's you need to worry modern machine. Let's try again. Okay, we can uh, adjust the holding timer. And now it's about uh, two seconds. Now we we adjust it to one second. Okay, begun. Faster than before. So you can see. Good. Okay. So now it's the I introduce our we int I introduce our pneumatic press machine. G L Y A K T uh, press machine. So bye everyone.